Days after the horror of the 9-11 attacks, the Valley experienced another senseless death. The killing of Balbir Singh Sodhi, a Sikh murdered outside of a Mesa gas station in a hate crime. 20 years later, the Sikh community and people of many different backgrounds gathered to remember the peaceful man who, in honor of his faith, wore a turban. Fox 10's Justin Lum is live now from the commemoration. Justin. And John Ellen, you can see what this man meant to the community. Dozens of people are still here filling this parking lot. Remember, this was the gas station Sodi owned. There's even a monument standing in his honor about 50 yards away from us. And what happened to him can only be, de be described as senseless hate. His brother tells me he lost him to pure ignorance. <laughs> A moment of peace to honor a man killed in the aftermath of chaos in our country two decades ago. 52-year-old Balbir Singh Sodi, a proud Sikh American, died here outside the Mesa Star Food Mart for nothing. I lost my brother because of ignorance, lack of education. Frank Roke is serving life in prison for the murder of Sodi. On September 15, 2001, he reportedly said a racial slur right before the shooting as backlash for the attacks on 9-11. Sodi became the first victim in a wave of hate crimes against South Asian and Muslim communities. He thought we are associated with terrorists, we are, we are part of Taliban, and that's, he, he has zero knowledge about Sikhi, about, about my religion. So Rana continues to fight racism, making it his mission to educate the youth, bringing communities together. As oppressed groups who share similar struggles, for long denied equity, sovereignty, and the similarities between our communities. Also uniting elected officials and several interfaith leaders. But still, Rana says there is much work to be done after societal setbacks like the tumultuous withdrawal from Afghanistan and anti-Asian hate crimes throughout the pandemic. And that's when we need to come out. Our leadership, our people need to love and understand each other and respect them. And I spoke to one Mesa officer working here at this event tonight. He said more than 20 years ago, he used to patrol this area during this beat. And he says, like many, he remembers Balbir Sodi as someone so welcoming, a good man all the time, smiling at others here at this gas station. Live in Mesa, Justin Lum, Fox 10 News.